Hey everyone, today we're going to check out Riffer 3.0 from Audio Modern. This is a random riff generator plugin. You can use the MIDI output from this plugin to play with any of your VST instruments. So let's check it out real quick. So all of that was completely randomly generated uh, just by picking a scale, picking a root uh, key, and then just playing it. So I hit infinite mode right here, which will just continue to randomly generate riffs in your scale and key uh, forever. So you could play this and it will come up with something new every single time. You saw some of the options I turned on over here. Well, I changed the uh, this from 16 notes to 8th notes in the middle of that and then also down here is the range that you want these notes to play with um, so you start there and you can go all the way down to C minus 2 up to G8 also when I enable tie notes over here you notice some of those notes will be tied together and it won't trigger you know continuous eighth notes every single time it sounds a bit more natural um, going over here the duration of the notes the velocity and then the density is pretty interesting I think when you turn it all the way up it's kind of got like a nice little stutter effect So just a few things that you can do with it. I think it's really cool to put this on a pad, um, you know, set the key that you want it in and put it on a pad. And it has this really, you know, kind of trippy evolving soundscape that will be created using whatever key and whatever scale you set. So it will always be changing throughout the song where you can just do it on plucks and get a melodic riffs like this and have it continuously changing throughout the song so it doesn't get repetitive. Um, there's a lot of things you can do with it, but again, I think it speaks for itself pretty much. It's a random riff generator plugin. If you ever run out of ideas, uh, it's very easy just to use this. Um, you can save presets and have little quick slots. If you like something a lot, you can just save it 
down here and then load it up for later. So there's a quite a few features that I'm kind of overlooking. I just want to briefly run down everything. So make sure to check out Audio Modern, their in-depth walkthroughs on this as well as reading the manual because again, it's a very complex uh, plugin and I don't have a lot of time, but that's just a quick look at Riffer 3.0. Thanks so much for watching. I will see you guys next time.